Hello, this is Tom Prokus with Tom Dog Almighty Tutorials, and today I will show you how to remove a Linux distro from a dual boot safely. Right now I'm in Zoran 6.2 and I'll be removing it um, and showing you exactly what to do not to destroy your master boot record when you remove it. So I am in Linux right now. I'm going to have to get out of here and go into Windows 7 to show you the rest of it. I will see you then. Hold on a minute. Okay, I'm back. Now we're on Windows 7 Pro. Okay, now what I want to do is I want to go to EaseUS Partition Manager. And here we are. You might want to download it if you don't have it. And we're going to check our partitions to see what we got. Okay, here we go. I have so many drives, it's crazy here. Okay, so let me see. Disk 1 is not the one I want. Disk 2, MBR, MB3, Toshiba, it's external, so we're looking at C. So let's look down here. Here's disk 2, C. This is my C drive. This is my other. This is Zoran 6.2, uh, and this is the swap area. We're going to want to delete both of these. So we're going to right click and go to delete partition. Go to OK. Right click, delete partition. OK. And then the most important thing you can do is right click on your basic MBR and rebuild MBR. Rebuild MBR. If you delete this because um, Linux will take over the boot member or the master boot member and if it does and you delete that this is unaccessible rebuild the MBR okay now we're going to go to apply yes and I made a mistake <laughs> Let's try this again. Rebuild the MBR. It says 2000 and XP. Nope. Windows 7. Okay. My bad. See how easy it is to make a mistake? Okay. It's going to update. So now we have unallocated 40 gigabytes and we have this. So we're going to want to extend this resize move partition we want it all back okay but and there we go now for me to do this it's going to take a reboot and then I'll come back to you in just a little bit hold on okay now we're back um, now that we've uh, repartitioned, deleted the old partitions, and restored it back to its previous state, we can go ahead and see now what the finished product, uh, product looks like. So we're going to go here again to Ease Us Partition Master. And we're going to take a look at what's on the drive. Voila. This two, all back to normal and that looks like about it now like I said right here you must if you delete anything here that has a boot record on it you must rebuild it make sure you put 7 XP not 8 I don't know if it's good with 8 it might work I don't think so but who knows that's for a later time um, you know make sure you re, re uh, build that master boot record or that'll be the death of you You'll spend another eight hours rebuilding uh, your computer. 
That's it for Tom Dog Almighty Productions. Have a good day, and uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.